Are you a victim of extortion? Uh, the country is on fire. Uh, there are protests all over the country. I've never seen anything like this. Many uh, graduation ceremonies are being canceled. They canceled, as you know, in Colombia. They're canceling a lot of them. And we have a president that just refuses to talk because he can't talk. You know that. So does everyone else. Uh, some of the statements made about this witch hunt on CNN, fake news CNN, uh, Michael Moore said the proof of falsifying records has not been accomplished. On Good Morning America, they said, we heard that expense payments to lawyers are legal expenses. You pay a lawyer expense payments. We didn't put it down as construction costs, uh, the purchase of sheetrock, uh, the electrical cost. The legal expense that we paid was put down as legal expense. There's nothing else you could say. You don't have to put down anything, I guess. But we put down legal expense was legal expense. Is that a correct statement, Mr. Attorney? And everyone's saying, oh, gee, that's the fraud. That's what they're trying to get us on. The fact that we call a legal expense a legal expense. They marked it down in the books. The check was signed. And the other thing, this was approved by all agencies. Everybody saw this. There was nothing being hidden at all. That's what they're all writing now. There's been nothing hidden. And it went through agencies, and I guess it went through the IRS also. It went through IRS. It went through the FEC. It went through everything. Also, NBC Today showed the challenges that there is no smoking gun, no email or tape to prove the president's intent. They don't have a way to prove that. That's NBC Today show. And then Fox News, Katie Chikaski, said that the gag order is unconstitutional, which of course it is. The gag order is unconstitutional. So with all that's going on, they have no case. Every single legal scholar that I see, I mean, maybe there's somebody out there, some whack job, but the, uh, for virtually every, everyone, everyone that I've seen has said there's absolutely no case. It's a case that shouldn't have been brought. The previous DA wouldn't bring it. Uh, Bragg didn't want to bring it, then he brought it because I'm running in, in number one place. This all comes out of the White House and crooked Joe Biden. This comes from the White House, and it's all Biden because it's an attack on his political opponent that hasn't happened in this country. It does happen in third world countries, but it hasn't happened in this country. And it's a shame. And the trial is a very unfair trial. It's a very, very unfair trial. The good news is they have nothing. Thank you.